there are four block i said building furniture and fittings plant and machinery and intangible furniture and fittings and intangible has only one rate 10% and 25% in building if the building is used for the residential purposes i explained yesterday also what is meant by the residential purpose the rate of depreciation is 5% the general rate for the building if nothing is given in the question you have to consider 10% rate normally you will not be given the rate you have to keep it in mind the rates normally it will not be provided to you you will have to keep it in mind depending on which asset and under which block it is falling in for the general building general rate is 10% temporary structure leave it i don't think they will give general rate take it as building 10% furniture both one and the same general rate okay plant and machinery plant and machinery general rate is 15% windmill windmill I don't think there is any other equipment. Ah, oh. windmill. Please write down here itself in this only somewhere. Fork lift equipment. Fork lift equipment. Windmill fork lift equipment. Both forty percent. Motor cars. open the bracket from here other than and close the bracket on high okay if the company assume that company in only with respect to motor car i am just uh, bifurcating the company company is normal company another company could be the company which uses the motor vehicles for the purpose of hiring like zoom ola uber those kind of stuffs okay that is whatever you have written in the bracket that falls under that i mean other companies like infosys tcs any other company software companies or manufacturing whatever it is which doesn't uses the motor vehicle running them on high for them whatever the motor vehicle or motor car purchased the rate of depreciation will be 15% if it is running the demo night double to this 15 to double 30% are you guys getting right okay books i don't think it is required just 40% keep it in mind aeroplanes which which are the companies which uses aircraft for the purpose of carrying of passengers or transportation of goods for them the rate of depreciation will be 40% understood give me a second i think i have little doubt in this aircraft okay aeroplane 40% sorry okay next please mark these things important Air pollution control equipment. Normally, you will get the question of this subject. Normally, this one, computer software, plant and machinery, building. Normally, you will get the question on these. 
ओके एयर पोल्यूशन कंट्रोल इक्विपमेंट वाटर पोल्यूशन कंट्रोल इक्विपमेंट मैन ट्रीटमेंट प्लांट दो सर ऑल फोर्टी परसेंट दिस इज ऑल डिप्रिसिएशन रेट्स कंप्यूटर्स इंक्लूडिंग कंप्यूटर सॉफ्टवेयर फोर्टी परसेंट शिप्स ट्वेंटी परसेंट ऑयल वेल्स फिफ्टीन परसेंट yesterday i told intangibles 25% that means whenever there is an purchase of asset if the asset is put to use less than 180 days then 50% of this rate should be considered if the asset is put to use more than 180 days same rate you should consider in income tax depreciation will be calculated on the block of asset concept block of asset means group of asset having the same class of asset falling under the same class having the same rate of depreciation understood okay uh, apart from these apart from these there may be some asset may come example ups UPS means what? Backup power supply. Uninterrupted power supply. Uninterrupted power supply UPS. Okay. It is plant and machinery actually. It will fall under plant and machinery. If if the UPS is exclusively connected to computers. what i meant if ups or generator is exclusively connected to computers then for that ups and the generator 40% equal to computers you should give the depreciation understood epbx box have you guys heard that Have you guys heard that EPBX box? It is a device. When a company calls to any outsider from the uh, what do you call the uh, telephone connection within the company, when they wants to call to the outsiders. the call will first go to the tpbx box then it will come to you okay you cannot call back to the same number because it will not get connected to the person from whom you have received the call that is the control mechanism they have devised and it will be implemented in most of the companies nowadays normally landline will not be there after the invention of mobiles Okay. If EPBX box is given in the question, you should consider it as plant. Fifteen percent rate of depreciation is given. Printer. Printer. Scanners. Printers. These are all computers. Okay, you have to give the depreciation at forty percent equivalent to computers. Understood? We will do one or two problems. After that, I told I will come back to this. Okay, if I come, if I explain this one. you may not able to understand hence i am holding it for few minutes once we familiar with how to calculate the depreciation then i will go back to that the 
this is the problem we will see illustration 2 after this i will go back to the illustration 1 okay illustration 2 m limited owns the following assets on 14 2022 you may not get this much assets you will get minimum 4 or 5 question will come on depreciation my gut feeling saying that you get sing one question for minimum 6 to 8 marks question you will get exclusively on depreciation okay we have to learn it properly m limited owns the following assets on 14 2022 assets they are given wdv as on 14 2002 that means opening wdv they have given the rate for the time being please ignore that rate is not given okay first see building a b c given have they mentioned anything about residential no sir no, no sir. in that case what is the rate for the building 10% 10% with this in this this one okay have they mentioned residential it would have been 5% if nothing specifically given you have to use the general rate for all the assets okay machinery c d e given have they given anything which is this one if they haven't given 30% 30% 30% you should use 15% rate understanding right you should use 15% rate furniture eap they have given general rate for furniture is 10% obviously there is no sub blocks within this main block 10% how many blocks are there building is one block machinery is another block furniture is another block three blocks you need to have three columns okay next these are all opening balance i will solve it don't worry did i explain what is block of asset how to solve i don't think have i i think i haven't explained no see block of asset block of asset means opening wdv whatever opening wdv is there for the respective blocks you have to you have to make whatever block of asset are there that much column you have to make it building plant and machinery furniture intangible asset computers how many block asset given that much columns you need to have the description particulars will be the same for all if opening wdv is given take it if opening wdv is not given don't take it that's it okay add addition additions means purchases in this purchase only you need to make is it more than 180 days or less than 180 days you have to bifurcate here itself whether the asset whatever you are purchasing has been put to use more than 180 days if yes please consider that amount if the asset is put to use less than 180 days please consider that asset i will just take building furniture okay in building there could be two in furniture there could be only less than in plant and machinery there could be more than 180 days like this can income it need 
not be if less than is there more than should not come like that there is no provision whenever the company purchases or any asset purchases the asset depending on the usage from when it has been started using those values will be plotted based on the usage against the usage okay company will be keep purchasing the asset numerous transactions will take place okay depending on the transaction we need to keep adding to any of these two rows after getting that you need to add sorry it will not come the total of these three will be this one i am again stressing these things may not be there may be there this from this value deduct money is payable money is payable is nothing but sale value whatever the sale value of the asset you need to deduct whatever you get is the wdv for depreciation purpose okay until here any doubt everything will be given whatever is given you need to take it if nothing is given don't take it okay any any doubt in this any question no okay you have to do like this next i'll just write rules rules means you have to keep this in mind it is not given <laughs> it will be there i i am not in a position to search all those things just remember this okay to provide depreciation there should be some value in the block what i meant i just take with the numbers 1000 is the wdv opening okay addition i will take 100 rupees there is no less than 180 days addition it is more than 180 days addition 1100 there is no sales that means the net value will be 1100 on this you need to provide depreciation depreciation will be calculated on the asset value right yes or no yes sir okay if there is a value you can calculate depreciation do you guys agree with that yes sir that is what i mentioned there should be some value in the block okay in this case you can calculate depreciation okay just here i will take for this 1000 value there are two buildings two buildings aggregate of those two building value is 1000 and you have constructed another two buildings the total value of the construction is 100 total how many buildings are there total how many buildings are there four buildings yes or no building in the sense in a company hr is hr has the separate building that is one building production may have two or three buildings each one constitute a separate building three finance one marketing one 
sales one like that separate separate buildings they have all those things the numbers of that value there are four buildings right all these four buildings have been sold for example have been sold for 500 rupees then what is the value remaining all four have been sold for 500 is there any building in you you have sold all four of your building is there any building no sir can you claim depreciation on this 600 now no sir why there is no no building at all on which you calculate depreciation if there is no building for which you are the owner you cannot claim depreciation no are you guys getting my point yes sir okay that means to provide depreciation there should be some value in the block and at least one asset must be there you guys agree yes assume that you have sold three buildings and you have sold it for 1500 is there any value on which you can claim depreciation no sir no because there is a negative that means the block of asset the wdv for depreciation purpose should be positive it should not be negative i mean to say on the negative value can you claim depreciation no on the positive value okay these minor points you guys need to remember since it is your descriptive paper i am telling had it been mcq i wouldn't have told in depth like this okay understood this is the one thing on this you need to calculate depreciation okay there is no sales value hence 1100 is there on this 10% you need to calculate depreciation at 10% because building has 10% on this 10% 110 whatever you get after providing depreciation is wdv closing wdv closing wdv is this one for the next year it becomes opening wdv understood guys ha ah. here i straight away took depreciation on this why because there is no asset which has been added during the year which has been put to use less than 180 days hence i can calculate on this value 10% direct percentage i can have had it been some value in this the methodology for calculating depreciation will differ okay that i will show if it is there in the problem any doubt in this no sir good okay here how many blocks building machinery furniture three blocks are there okay just building you need to have one block you add all three three these three amount put it as opening wdv machinery you have one more column add these three put it under the machinery column furniture two assets are there put it in furniture column 1 lakh 8 1 lakh 10 plus 8 1 lakh 18000 like this just I, i will take furniture i will take furniture 
register 1,18,000. I will take it like this. And opening the building. If building is there, building. How much it is there? 20,000. Five lakh forty, six lakh thirty-five thousand. How much it comes building? Twenty-one lakh ninety-five thousand. Like that. Plant and machinery. One lakh sixty-five. You guys need to do in the same way. Since I am doing it now, since we are in the opening WDV, like this. Understood, guys? Whatever opening WD we given, I have taken it. Any doubt in this? No. Why I aggregated all this, put it into one group? Because same rate, same class of asset. Had it been building be residential, I would have taken that building in the another column. Building hyphen residential, I would have maintained. I took. I would have taken only the building which has same rate of depreciation, same class, in one one block, and the residential in another block. How many block of assets are there? You need to maintain that much column. Understood? Yes, sir. Okay. Next. The following assets are acquired. Acquired means purchased by the company during the previous year, 22-23. Building D, what is the rate of depreciation? 10. Actual cost is how much? 540. Put to use date is how much? I told yesterday also, when the put to use date is not given, date of acquisition only you need to take. How much? 540. Building D. 540 means, now we need to calculate. 180 days. How to calculate this 180 days? My question is This is 1st April 22 beginning of the year this is 31 3 23 closing year okay now 180 days how to calculate from this date or from this date backwards or from this date forward 180 days how many days we have used how to calculate? I mean from the backward calculation or forward calculation? from this date okay backward we will see when it falls okay March February Jan December November October One eighty, it should come minimum. 
How many days in March? How many days in March? 31. 31 February. Usually 28. January 31. December 31. November 30. How many days? 151. How much I need? 180. That means I need to get 29 days in October, right? Yes, sir. Uh, October 29 means from backward you calculate 29. How many days in October remains? How many days in October remains if you have taken 29? Four days. That means, that means any asset put to use after 3rd October, it will be less than 180 days. Are you guys getting? If any asset is purchased or put to use after 3rd October. That means if any asset is put to use on 5th October, it will be used less than 180 days during the previous year. Do you guys agree? Yes, sir. Okay. 3rd October is the cutoff date. 3rd October and before. More than 180 from 4th October till 31st March, it is less than 180. Understood? Please keep it in mind. 3rd October is the cutoff date. Okay, based on that, based on that, you have to populate the amount. Is it 180 days or more or less than 180 days depending on the date of purchase or put to use date here building the purchase uh, purchase for how much 540 what is the date of purchase 14 5 is it more than 180 or less than 180 This date, more than 180 days or less than 180 days during the previous year, 22-23? More than 180. More than 180. I like 40,000. Eh. Like that. Machinery F, 16,000. What is the date? 21.9. Is it more than 180 or less than 180? This is also more than 180. Machinery 16,000. Next. Patent. Know how. Were there any opening balance relating to this patent and know how? No. You can call it as intangible. There is no opening balance zero. Now you have to see what is the date. 15, 4, 17, 5. Both are more than 180. Total 1 lakh. Are you guys understanding? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, depending on the date of purchase. If date of purchase and put to use date are given, you have to see if the date of purchase pertains to pre earlier previous years, first thing. If no, you should ignore date of purchase. You have to consider only the put to use date. Now, is there any sale? We will see. The 
following assets are sold they are sold machine c and e they have sold how much they have sold 110 plus 80 here date of sale is irrelevant what is it date of sale is irrelevant how much 110 plus 80 is how much 190 which is machinery only machinery they have sold minus 190 how much balance is there for machinery no sir that 5 lakh 40 thousand is for building not for furniture this one yes okay Thank you so much. Understood? Ah, oh, see, here while putting, have one more column rate of depreciation 10%, same 10%, here it is 30%, 25%. there is nothing complications in this why because all the sets are more than 180 days all these assets whatever you have purchased is more than 180 days hence no complications at all that means i will calculate depreciation on this closing directly for all. Easy, whatever the closing WDB for depreciation purpose is there, multiplied by rate of depreciation since it is more than 180 days all and deduct the depreciation calculated from the depreciation for WDV for depreciation minus depreciation you get the closing WDV. Building two seventy three five hundred. Have we got two seventy three five hundred? Machinery block two thirteen five hundred. Machinery block two thirteen five hundred. Furniture block 3, 11,800. 11,800. Intangible block 4, 25,000. 25,000. Have we got the same one? Whatever they have calculated. Total 3,23,800. It is nothing but 
total of this. No need to have the totals. No need to have the totals, okay? machines namely a and b machines plant and machinery namely a and b as on 1st april 2022 is rupees 6 lakhs opening wdv 6 lakhs machine c was acquired on 12 11 22 for rupees 3 lakhs and put to use on the same date less than 180 days or more than 180 days see this one more than one eighty. Less than more than. More than sir. So. Is it more than one eighty days or less than one eighty days? Less than sir. So. How? Oh. We have to compete from that side. Huh. After 3rd October, it has been purchased and put to use after 3rd October? Yes, sir. Uh, then it is less than 180. Please con keep it in mind the 3rd October date. On or before 3rd October, more than 180. After 3rd October, less than 180. Please remember this. Okay? Put to use on the same date. On this date, they have put to use. Machine C, whatever they have purchased, they have sold it for rupees 4 lakhs. They are asking us to calculate depreciation. Okay. See, you have to be very careful. Machinery has been sold 3 lakhs, 4 lakhs. Hence, I will not calculate depreciation on machine C. No such concept. Okay. This is the one, right? Machinery, 15%. I will use, just use number of machines. Oh, what is the... Opening WDV, 6 lakhs. How many machines were there? Two. Have you purchased one more machine? C. What is the cost of purchase and put to use? 3 lakhs. Yes or no? Yes, Which machine you have sold? One. What is the cost of the machine sold? Sale value, 4 lakhs. What is the WDV? Five lakhs. Yeah. Don't calculate depreciation like this. Now you have to be careful. Understood? Whatever it is given, I have just plotted. I have not at all calculated anything. They have given the opening WDV I have taken. Whatever the addition they have given, I have taken. I got the total. From that, one machine have been sold. They mentioned C. Okay, whatever they have purchased, they have sold. The closing WDV came to 5 lakhs. Now you need to calculate depreciation. Understand it properly now. If there is any sale, if there is any sale and there is any addition 
of any asset which has been put to use less than 180 days. Any addition which has been put to use less than 180 days. Ignore sale. If there is sale is it there or not, ignore. If there is any addition which has been put to use less than 180 days while calculating depreciation, you have to calculate the depreciation taking it to account taking into account or compare the WDV for depreciation purpose with the value of the asset which has been put to use less than 180 days. What you need to do to calculate depreciation, first you need to compare this value with this value. Any confusion? Comparing, is there any confusion? No, sir. Uh, if WDV for depreciation is more than the value of asset which has been put to use less than 180 days, then calculate depreciation first on this value which has been put to use less than 180 days at the prescribed rate multiplied by 50 percent. Okay. This one. Please, can you repeat that? One second, I will calculate and repeat. This one multiplied by rate of depreciation multiplied by 50%. Why 50%? Since it has been put to use less than 180 days. Listen first. Carefully listen, everyone. If there is any asset which has been put to use less than 180 days, while calculating depreciation, first we need to compare the WDV for depreciation purpose value with the value of the asset which has been put to use less than 180 days. If WDV for depreciation purpose value is more than the asset which has been put to use less than 180 days, then calculate depreciation on this less than 180 days value first. On calculating uh, for this problem, I got 22500. And whatever the balance is there, balance means this value minus this value. On that, calculate full year depreciation for the remaining value of the asset. Understood? You want me to tell again? For more than 180 days, again, sir. For more than 180 days, you need to take the difference of these two. WDV for depreciation purpose minus value of the asset which has been put to use less than 180 days. Take the difference. Multiplied with the rate of depreciation. 2 lakhs into 15%, 30,000. First, always you should assign the depreciation for the less than 180 days. Then if there is any balance, if there is any balance, for that balance you need to calculate the full year depreciation. WDV for depreciation, you get closing WDV.
how they can't depreciation on file like at 15%. Machine was sold on 31st March. Yes, but in in depreciation, normally individual asset loses its identity. It will combine to the block. This is the correct depreciation, 447 find that is the correct one. What they have given in the question for B? The first one, I think it is wrong. This depreciation, whatever they are calculating, that is wrong. Once it has been put combined with the block, the individual character of the machine or identity of the machine is lost. Normally what they will do is 3 lakh only they will take and 1 lakh they will take to profit and loss account. That is that should not be done in the case of PPC. In block of asset, whatever the value on which you sell the asset, it uh -huh. will be taken. Even if it is sold for a profit. Yes. According to me, whatever the amount they have calculated, 1 and 3, according to me, is wrong. Because once you combine the asset or put the asset or merge the asset into the block, individual identity of the asset is lost. Even if you sell these two instead of this one, the same way we have to calculate. Okay. Understood, guys. This one how to calculate depreciation less than 180, more than 180 days if both the assets are there? even if it comes here also first you need to provide this one on the balance you need to provide at the rate rate of depreciation that will be more than 180 days please copy this one i will go to the point f You guys want to break? Yes, sir. Okay. Take a break. 15 minutes. Now it is 6.15. Come back at 6.30. It is 15 minutes. Uh, 6.15 now. Come back at 6.30. We can continue with point 0.9 and there are many more remaining in this depreciation, not yet over. Not yet over, I think entire class of this, of today's class, maybe go for depreciation itself. Okay, come back at 6.30. Don't log off. Don't log off, okay? See you soon.